turning now to the coronavirus. While the initial surge of COVID-19 cases in the state may be over, one local doctor warns that although summer is near, the coronavirus is still here and it is here to stay. Western Mass News reporter Lindsay Kane joins us now live in Springfield with more. Lindsay. A research model here in Western Mass predicts the death toll in the state will rise significantly by early next month. While cases of COVID-19 in the state continue to decline, many people are trying to resume life as normal. But Nicholas Reich, associate professor of biostatistics at UMass Amherst, has created models predicting the death rate from COVID-19 in the state, currently hovering around 7,500, will rise by another 833 by the 4th of July. I certainly fear, as many others do, that as we reopen, um, there is in inevitably that will create more opportunities for transmission. Dr. Erica Hamilton in the microbiology department at UMass Amherst tells Western Mass News over the phone that as the weather gets warmer, it's easier for people to fall off track. So far, we've been doing really well in Massachusetts. It's been an extremely difficult time. People are super frustrated. And what uh, a lot of public health people and a lot of researchers are worried about is that it's summer now. Uh, people don't associate summer with being sick, we associated with that, with fall and winter. She says, well, the numbers are just a prediction. It's important to remember people's actions will be the ultimate factor. They are just models and they are very much influenced by people's behavior. So we could do very well in the state if people continue to follow instructions or we could have a, a, the beginnings of a second spike. A message Reich hopes will stick with the public. We have to hope that people will have learned from the isolation and the scar the scar of these last few months and how uh, the toll that it's taken that um, we have to take this seriously going forward. Hamilton stresses the importance of washing your hands and following state protocols for the days and months ahead. Live in Springfield, Lindsay Kane, Western Mass News.